Good afternoon. From the beginning of my campaign for this office, and since I was sworn in as board president, I have said that one of our top priorities is reforming the criminal justice system in Cook County. I'm here today to announce that our Judicial Advisory Council is being reorganized to better serve this purpose. My top priority is increasing the efficiency in the current system by reducing the nonviolent offender population and improving the reentry process to lower the recidivism rate. Rather than continu continuing a cycle of arrest and rearrest, we must shift our focus to prevention and intervention. We must expand drug treatment programs so that people can get well rather than cycling through the criminal justice system at great social and economic cost to all of us. Rather than investing in detaining people in the jail at $143 a day, we must invest in treatment, education, and job skills training. I have charged the Judicial Advisory Council to find innovative, innovative solutions that will dramatically reduce our jail population a challenge, but since approximately 70 percent, I'll say that again, 70 percent of the population is detained on nonviolent offenses, not as difficult as it might seem. The Judicial Advisory Council will work with all of the stakeholders, independent elected officials, the city, and community-based organizations to develop and implement a number of specific strategic targets. We will work to improve the flow of information at bond court to reduce the number of people detained on bond and increase the use of electronic monitoring to allow people to maintain employment and continue in school. We will also develop a strategic reentry approach to reentry to improve the, the detainees' reintegration into the community, hopefully reducing recidivism. Overall, we intend to improve access to diversion programs within the jail and the court system to provide people with substance abuse treatment and treatment for mental illness. In pursuing these objectives, it's imperative to remember that each of the stakeholders and offices that work in the criminal justice system have an equally important and equally unique role to play. That being said, I'd remind everyone that we also operate in a larger context, one that impacts families, neighborhoods, and society as a whole. Each stakeholder must remember how their individual mission fits into this larger context. The goal of the Judicial Advisory Council is to unite these missions and create a criminal justice system that is more efficient, more effective, and more compassionate. Good afternoon, and I'd like to thank President Preckwinkle for the opportunity to serve in this capacity. I am delighted to head up a team that will oversee this important undertaking. Our team is wholeheartedly committed to the President's priority of improving public safety while at the same time improving quality of life by strengthening families and stabilizing communities. President Preckwinkle certainly understands the interconnectedness of the criminal justice system and the need to change policies and practices in a broad way. The Judicial Advisory Council will partner with all members of the criminal justice constellation separately elected officials, the city, as well as community-based organizations and groups to bring about the change that our current system needs and that the people of Cook County deserve. We will hear from all of the stakeholders to identify the underlying needs and interests and to ensure the most creative and sustainable ideas are explored. Through this collaboration, we expect to deliver innovative solutions towards creating a more efficient and resourceful criminal justice system. Thank you.